Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I am in my hallway, um, ready to tackle my hall closet. Um, I had it very organized, but you know, you buy things and you kind of like shove them in the closet and then they pile up and then you buy more stuff and put more stuff in the closet. <laughs> and before you know it, it looks like mine. So. I'm going to work hard today to get it all nice and neat and organized back to the way I like it. I hope you enjoy. Okay, so here is our hall closet. Don't mind the blue. We still need to paint the inside. Um, this is the color that our entire house was when we bought it. Um, but this is what our closet is looking like. bottom is just our clothes hamper and our plunger so that's not a big deal but those baskets need to be organized I need to find a spot for um, the uh, extra band-aids and the heat patches um, our soaps and our extra toothpastes um, and organize just a little bit up there so let's get to work. We're gonna start by taking everything out So just kidding, I didn't need to take this bin out. It's just extra sheets, pillowcases, bathroom rugs. Um, so that's gonna stay. That shelf's cleared out. This is hand towels, washcloths, body towels. All that's okay. I'll probably just make the towels look a little bit neater. Um, that's emptied. And like I said, that's just our hamper and our plunger. And then everything. ready to get sorted. Here we go. I have a pup that wants to say hi. <laughs> say hi, sister. <laughs> you showing your princess collar off? Showing your princess collar off? Oh, okay, 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 thank you. Okay, so I also grab um, a couple bags because when I do this clean out, I always find things that are like expired or we don't use and that can get tossed. So I'm gonna start um, going through all this stuff. I've been watching you from a distance as I turn out all the lights. All I want from you is to listen and remember the good times. If you think of all that we leave out, is that weird you're feeling good? I know nothing ever turned out as you wanted to. But every time I feel it, comment down below if you love Great Wolf Lodge as much as we do. Okay, here is the chaos. <laughs> but I promise it's going to be beneficial to pour everything out and get everything organized. Um, and then to wipe out my bins, I'm just gonna use the Iowa Pine Scent Mrs. Myers to clean out my bins. And there's my helper again. Hey girl, hey girl, you helping? What are you doing? <laughs> Can you sit? Sit. Stella, sit. Sit. Good girl, good girl, oh, good girl. <laughs> All right, let's wipe these up. Yeah, I know I will learn the hard way, cause I just can't leave it be. And I don't really care what they say, it's all about you and me.
First aid, band-aids and ointments and gauze and um, the little, um, I don't know, band-aid tape, <laughs> all in here. tooth fairy boxes that our dentist gives out so sweet so sweet everything you need to have clean chompers <laughs> extra toothbrushes toothpaste flossers mouthwash you name it it's in this bin husband's bin my bin I mean the great wolf lodge anyone can use um, but I just stuck it in here and kiddos medicine bin and then back here I just have some um, uh, thermometers a syringe and a medicine syringe and the little nose thing but we use it more for like ears need be now because they're way big enough to blow their own noses <laughs> just like to have it on hand because yeah I never know smaller closet um, it has tons of storage don't get me wrong but it's kind of hard to see when I'm standing in front of it um, so I'm going to just show you the before and then the after um, after I put everything back in and then kind of like give you the rundown okay so I'm gonna show you the final product in just a minute um, but I wanted to tell you also this is a really good time to go through and see what you need um, or even what you would like to have a backup of. Um, and so for us, I know um, some extra baby wipes, we just love to have those on hand all the time. They're great for everything, even though we have no babies in our house anymore. Hand soap, uh, Dio, uh, deodorant, kiddo body wash, just for like a backup, mom and dad body wash as a backup, shampoo, conditioner, and we're running low on flossers. So um, we have all of these things, but just to have um, some backups this is the most important hand soap because I have no extra hand soap so 
we have to definitely grab that first um, off of this list. And then I would say probably flossers um, next because we go through those rather quickly with uh, a family of four always flossing their teeth. So let me go ahead and show you the final result. Okay, so here is the final result. It looks so nice and neat and organized. I love it. It's so much better for my family and I to be able to find things this way. Um, so I'll give you a quick rundown. This is extra bed sheets, pillowcases, bathroom rugs, um, and then some different things that we either don't use often or have backups of. Um, so like the lotion, that huge Duramax, we actually do use that often because you see it's almost out. Some tissue packs that my boys carry in their backpacks and I carry with me. Um, flashlight, because you never know when you need a flashlight. So we have two of those up there. And then everything you need to take care of your chomps. <laughs> this is for kiddos and adults in our house. And then this is the adult medicine bin the kiddo medicine bin and thermometers and baby Vicks and things like that. This is like the first aid bin. It has um, like hydrocortisone cream, the Benadryl stick, band-aids, Aquaphor, uh, gauze, big band-aids, you name it, it's in here. And then we have the huge hydrogen peroxide and alcohol back in there. Um, towels, like I said before, I didn't really touch them. I just made them look a little bit nicer. Um, and then hand towels and washcloths in this bin. Um, and I like that you can pull it out for easy access, um, to what you need to grab. And then this is like my bin. Like I said, it just has body spray, some travel stuff, face masks, foot care, leg care, um, different things like that. Our little Great Wolf Lodge, <laughs> um, Samples. And like I said, anyone can use these. I just stuck them in my bin, but anyone's welcome to use them, of course. Um, and then my husband's bin, and then he also has um, our face soap in his. And then the kiddos' hair and skin, and there's a little sunscreen back there as well. And then this is cotton balls, Q-tips, some microfiber um, cleaning cloths for like our glasses, some witch hazel, um, actually shouldn't put that in there um what else is in there oh and then just some extra plugins I'm gonna actually stick this we have one in our bathroom cabinet too so that's like a backup so I'm gonna stick that back there with those bigger bottles um of the peroxide and alcohol so we have everything we need right there with the witch hazel and aquaphor all that uh but yeah that's it it looks so much better so much more organized and I have a whole grocery bag, um, a whole Walmart bag full of garbage to throw out. So I would say that was pretty and successful. A of garbage. A whole heavy Walmart bag full. See? See what you find when you clean out? Expired things or things you don't use. Thank <laughs> you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you got some motivation to start off 2022 cleaning out an area in your house. Um, Thank you for watching. Give this video a thumbs up, please. Subscribe for more videos like this and stay peaceful.